Electric vehicles are everywhere nowadays, and they can be anything from scooters to medical helicopters to farm equipment. They fly, they drive, and even haul manure. I'm Glenn, and today we are bringing you 15 electric personal transports that can be useful in all kinds of situations. Thank you for watching Mind's Eye Design. Number 15. The T31 Micro is a new electric scooter from zero emissions vehicles. Ideal for light delivery or short commutes, this three-wheel trike is fully enclosed and has room for three people. This scooter has no pedals and uses handlebars for all light controls. Number 14. An Australian invention and design, the DC Tri by Movement Tech, is an excellent alternative to the Segway. A universal stand-up electric trike, the DC Tri is more stable, safer, and easier to ride than a two-wheel bike. Featuring high-quality bike components, this chrome molly frame trike has a low center of gravity and supports riders up to 260 pounds. The e-bike has a zero-turn radius and doesn't require pedaling. Number 13. This is a revolutionary way for people with disabilities to have the chance to regain the benefits of therapy, position control, transfers, and mobility. Able Chair enables users to be put in various positions using a phone app for added convenience. This has a full range of adjustments, including seat and tilt angle and limitless positions. Other benefits of the chair include pressure relief for a range of motion, improved bone density, stretching the muscles, increased circulation, improved lung function, and eliminating poor posture. Number 12. A prototype, the Stealth Electric ATV, is an all-terrain 600cc utility four-wheeler with battery power comparable to a 300cc four-wheeler. This eliminates both noise pollution and carbon emissions. The 4 kilowatt lithium-ion battery pack can be charged in six hours and has a range of up to 35 miles. An optional second battery pack can add up to 30 more miles to the range. Number 11. The Zero Dual Sport and Dual Sport Rider have an all-electric drivetrain with an increased range and a power boost. You can change between economy and sports mode at the press of a button. A carbon fiber belt connects the rear wheel and motor for acceleration and performance is continuously updated through the Zero app. This can be charged overnight with any standard wall outlet or a charge tank option. Can charge the battery up to six times faster with recharging taking as little as an hour. Number 10. The Zero XU Street Tracker is a custom-made electric bike that was modified by Colt Wrangler. He took a 2013 Zero XU and added LED lighting, aluminum bodywork, and a new rear wheel. Most of the original bike was black, so he added the aluminum bodywork for contrast. He replaced the original 16-inch wheel with a 19-inch wheel and moved around the electrical components while keeping the original wiring harness. The signature feature of the bike is the sculptured headlight and number plate combo. It was made with four pieces and took Colt almost three days to complete. The tail section is a combination that was inspired by both flat trackers and super bikes. Number 9. Perfect for bigger cities and urban areas, the Toyota iRoad is a three-wheeled, two-seat trike that holds two people sitting one behind the other. This is small and only three feet wide and seven feet long. Current lean technology gives you the same experience as riding a two-wheeler. A small turning radius, increased maneuverability, and no need to remain stable when stationary or at low speeds. The system moves the wheels in opposite directions up and down, 
and can apply a lean angle to counteract the centrifugal force. Operating on a stepped surface while being driven straight, it compensates for body level and the road surface. Number 8 Cora Kitty Hawk is a flying taxi that has 12 independent rotors that lift it straight up, taking off like a helicopter and eliminating the need for runways. Cora was made to fly over traffic, saving time on commutes. This last year, Cora has added to their fleet, had over 400 test flights, and tested the parachute. The flying taxi includes a triple redundant flight computer and has a cruising speed of 112 miles per hour. After eight years of development, they are one step closer to realizing their hopes. Cora has now partnered with Air New Zealand to start the next phase of their evolution. They are also opening a software development base in Atlanta this year. Number seven. Better known for cheap scooters and small motorcycles, Kimco has introduced their first fully electric superbike, the Super NEX. Shown for the first time at the Milan show, this bike is expected to have a top speed of 155 miles per hour. Able to get from zero to 60 in under three seconds, the NEX has a full engagement performance system, helping less experienced riders have a perfect takeoff. To make a better rider experience, the bike has six gears and they fitted it with an acoustic motor that produces the sounds of gears changing and a revving engine. Number six. The Uno Bolt is a self-balancing one-wheeled electric scooter that uses gyro force technology for balance. Like the Segway, this moves forward by leaning toward the front, and when you lean back, it slows down and applies the brakes. The Bolt has a range of 25 miles and a 45-minute charge time from empty to full. If the Bolt is too much for you, Uno now has a Bolt Mini. This is designed to ride either standing up or sitting down and has a charge time of one hour with a range of up to 15 miles. You can get a more extended 23-mile range if you go for the long-range battery. Number five. Created by Polish aerospace company Jetson Aero, the Jetson Speeder prototype is a single-seat EVTOL capable of carrying a person that weighs up to 220 pounds. Jetson Aero spent a lot of time testing, building, and programming the prototype from scratch. The hover bike, powered by eight electric motors and lithium-ion batteries, has a flight time of 15 minutes. They are now working on designing a lightweight carbon fiber frame and improving on charging and battery power. Number four. A modern reboot of the 60s and 70s beach buggy, the ID Buggy, is an electric vehicle by Volkswagen. This has a 150 kilowatt motor that powers the rear wheels and then sends the drive to the front axle using an electric prop shaft. The buggy can also detach from the chassis. Although this may not be mass produced, Volkswagen is going to offer the platform of the electric car to other manufacturers so they could build upon their platform. Number three. Intended to be a zero emission helicopter used for transporting human organs, the Robinson Electric Helicopter is a converted Robinson R44. They remodeled it and then added 67 kilowatt hour lithium polymer batteries from Bramo. The helicopter uses twin electric motors from race car engineering and electric specialty company Reinhardt Motion Systems. At a test flight from Los Alamitos Airfield, the aircraft reached a speed of 92 miles per hour at 800 feet and covered 34.5 miles in just over 22 minutes. Number two. Launching in Vancouver, British Columbia, Vimo, specially designed for shared use, are accessible by using the smartphone app to reserve a vehicle and manage your trip. The Vimo comes with automatic smart locks, turn signals, daytime and nighttime lighting, and is made of a lightweight composite body. 
These electric assist cycles are a terrific way to get around the city. And you can even ride them in bike lanes. Number one. The Coolin Electric is a lightweight electric powered utility vehicle designed for tasks like carrying cattle feed, hauling loads of produce, and other things you might need to do on a farm. This is a quad that weighs only 660 pounds, but can haul up to 2,200 pounds. The all-electric Kulin is a concept at this stage, but the team behind it has every intention of bringing the innovative machine to market. and thank you for watching. I'm Chandni with Mind's Eye Design. We love to hear your feedback, so please leave some comments below and let us know your favorite from this video and why you liked it. If you have an idea for a future video, leave another comment and let us know. And then if we use your idea, we'll give you a shout out in that video. But don't leave yet. Keep watching because there's more.